Welcome to MCCT, Microcrawler Capability Test. That's where we test and compare the driving performance and capability of micro trucks and micro crawlers from 1 to 18th to 1 to 24th scale trucks in stock condition as well as highly modified and upgraded ones. The trucks have to pass through 10 different tests. We'll get either points for their results or their performance will be graded. And the final scores will reveal the most capable micro crawlers. We check their climbing ability, descent performance, their tilt angle, their performance in overcoming easy and difficult obstacles, and their low speed modulation and low speed driving performance. Check the description for details of tests, scores, and mode of grading. Now let's start and present this episode's test trucks. And here are the test trucks of MCCT episode 5. The ECX Barrage FPV and the Charisma MSA-1E, the Subaru brand. The ECX Barrage FPV has a wheelbase of 120.6 mm and a weight of 244 grams. Its tires are Falcon Wild Peak MT with 46 by 17 mm. It runs on a small nickel metal hydride battery with four cells and 4.8 volts and it has a barrage 50 size motor in center position. The Charisma MSA 1E Subaru Brad has a wheelbase of 125 millimeters, a weight of 265 grams and tires with 47 by 19 millimeters. It runs on a six cell nickel metal hydride battery with 7.2 volts and only 130 milliamp hours. It has a 50 sized motor in center position. And now let's start with test one. Climb on a rough surface, 45 degrees. A little trouble for the barrage, not for the charisma. 46 degrees. No problem for the charisma, but it was for the ECX barrage. And 47 degrees. Finally, too much for the barrage. Super weak battery. No problem for the Charisma, 48 not either, 49 degrees, little bit of struggling and 50 degrees is finally too much also for the Charisma MSA1E Subaru bread. So the Charisma could do 49 degrees, gets 4 points for this and the ECX Barrage FPV 1 point for 46 degrees. Here we see all results in test 1 of all 15 trucks tested so far. You will see this episode's test trucks are not top and the ECX Barrage is super poor. And now to test 2, climb on a smooth surface. The ECX Barrage does already have troubles 45 degrees. No problem for the Charisma and 46 degrees ECX Barrage, super weak batteries, really lacking power and isn't even able to climb 46 degrees. No problem for the Charisma, 47 not either, at 48 degrees it's already struggling a little bit. 49 degrees for the Charisma Travels, but still can do it. And finally, 50 degrees. That's too much also for the Charisma. And here the results of test 2, climb on a smooth surface, ECX Barrage only 45 degrees, 0 points, and the Charisma MSA1E Subaru Pred 4 points for 49 degrees. And here all 15 trucks tested so far. Test 2 Climb Smooth Surface, the Charisma MSA1E Subaru Brad 49 degrees, 10th place so far with the CR24 Jeep and Bronco, so not really good. And the ECX Barrage FPV, super poor power, super weak, only 45 degrees, last in line here. And now to test 3. 
going down on a steep incline, stop and going up again. 45 degrees, not a big problem for both trucks. Forty six not either and forty seven the ECX barrage has a big troubles because of its super poor low speed modulation and poor power. That's the main problem of the ECX barrage here. Forty seven degrees not a big problem for the Charisma Subaru Red 48 degrees that's finally too much for the ECX Barrage mainly because of its lacking power Subaru Red can still do 48 degrees but 49 degrees that's finally also too much for the Charisma Subaru Bread super hard to steal check the front wheels it is not able to do 49 degrees so here are the results of test 3 descent and stop and go back up again 47 degrees for the ECX barrage one point and 48 degrees for the Charisma MSA 1E Subaru Bread 1.5 points here and here test 3 descent results of all 15 trucks tested so far no top results of MCC T5 test trucks in this and now to test 4 and 5 tilt angle to the left and to the right the ECX barrage to the left it can stand till 43.5 degrees quite good and the Charisma Subaru Bread It's even better. Forty four point one degree to the left and to the right the ECX barrage. Forty three point four degrees and the Subaru bread. Again, even better. Forty four point five degrees. Here are the results of test 4 and 5. The ECX barrage 43.5 degrees to the left, 5.75 points for this and 43.4 degrees to the right, 5.7 points and the Charisma MSA 1E Subaru Bread even better, 44.1 degrees, 6.05 points and 44.5 degrees, 6.25 points for this. And here the results of all 15 trucks tested so far, tilt angle left and right, test 4 and 5 and today's test trucks did good in this test. And now to test number 6, the hill of branches, the flat side, the ECX barrage is struggling hard, hard, hard nearly not controllable it's lacking power and lacking low speed modulation nearly undrivable however it can do the flat side of the hill of branches but only 0.5 points for this no problem for the Charisma MSA 1E Subaru Bread. So 
Here, test number six, flat hill of branches, 0 0.5 out of two points for the ECX barrage and the Charisma MSA 1E Subaru Pre, two out of two points. And now to test seven, the steep side of the hill of branches, but that's much too difficult for the ECX barrage, no chance. The Charisma, it's struggling hard and once it nearly could do it, but it's also lacking power and struggling, struggling, struggling. It's also too difficult for the Charisma MS A1E Subaru Bread. So test 7, steep hill of branches. No points here for the Barrage and the Charisma. And now to test number 8, the hill of pebble stones, river stones, flat side. The ECX Barrage needs speed. It can do it, but needs a little bit of speed. No problem for the Charisma MSA 1E Subaru Brett here. So test 8, the Barrage gets 1 out of 2 points and the Charisma gets 2 out of 2 points. And now to test number 9, the steep side of the hill of table stone. And the ECX Barrage, that's a big surprise. It's not a total failure. It's lacking power. It's lacking low speed modulation control. But with speed, it kind of can do this super difficult obstacle. Wow, who would have thought this? It simply needs better electronics and more power. It has a super good approach angle. Still kind of uncontrollable, but it gets to the top and also could kind of do it. And also the charisma Subaru Red has a really good approach angle. It doesn't have as good tires as the ECX Barrage, but it also managed kind of uncontrollable to do this super, super difficult obstacle. So that's a big surprise now. Here are the results. Both could kind of do it and get 0.5 out of 10 points for this. Both were not controllable, but were able to do this super difficult test. And now to the last test. Test 10, low speed modulation, low speed performance. The ECX Barrage. Probably by far worst truck in this so far. There is nearly no low speed modulation. Additionally, it's lacking power. Super, super poor. Impossible to climb this step and not fall on the other side. So, absolutely no points for this. The Charisma MSA1E Subaru Brad. It does have a really quite nice low speed modulation. Not bad at all, also can bash a little bit. can climb the step, lacks power also, so probably due to the nickel metal hydride batteries. 
And those are the results for the ECX barrage for this no points at all. And the Charisma Subaru Brad, little better than the Hobby Plus CR24 trucks maybe, but maybe not as good as the Axial SCX24 with the old electronics. So 1.5 points for this in the last test test number 10 of mcct5 and here are the results the final score of mcct episode 5 clear winner of course the charisma msa 1e subaru bread which did quite well and received all in all 27.8 points it did have only one failure test 7 the steep side of the hill of branches and the ecx barrage fpv super poor performance check the points it got 11.45 points out of its only 15.45 points in tests 4 and 5 what's the tilt angle to the left and to the right in all other tests it had super poor results however in some way it managed to do the super difficult obstacle number 9 as the charisma msa 1e did and received 0.5 points for this and so even with its super poor performance if we check all trucks tested so far and the final score after mcct5 we see the ecx barrage fpv on place 10 out of 15 trucks tested so far because it did have only one failure and all trucks that failed to climb two tests as the hg18 tiger dog and the mini c4x4 they are ranked below however the ecx barrage has quite a potential it has super poor electronics and super super poor batteries and changing electronics and batteries will make this a way better crawler the charisma msa 1e subaru bread plays 8 after mcct5 so did quite well way better than the ecx barrage 27.8 points so similar to the best stock hobby plus year 24 and that's it for mcct5 micro crawler capability tests check out for the next episodes of mcct there are still a lot of trucks to be tested mcct will be back